Joining us in studio, we have Representative Greg Gianforte. Thanks for waking up with us. Samantha, good to be with you. And of course, the topic of conversation today, the President's rally last night, uh, maybe some takeaways from your opinion on the President's speech. Well, it was, it was such an honor to be with the President and have him here in Billings, uh, talking to so many enthusiastic people. Uh, and the themes were very clear. This uh, presidency, uh, he's been doing an amazing job. You know, our economy is booming. We have more jobs. For the first time in decades, we have more jobs open in this country than we have people looking for work. Wages are going up, and our country is becoming more secure. And the audience last night was enthusiastic about it. And we obviously noticed you and Senator Steve Daines were on the plane on Air Force One with the president when he caught here to Billings. Um, not often do you have the ear of the president like that for a, for a long period of time. What did you guys talk about? Well, we talked about forest management. Coming into, first, I want to say it's, I pinch myself a little bit. It's just a, it's kind <laughs> it's understandable. of understandable. It's an amazing experience. And to have that quality time, to see his heart for this country and how hard he's working. Uh, and uh, coming in on Air Force One into Billings, you know, we saw the Yellowstone River. And it's just, you know, anytime a Montanan gets home, you, you just feel it in your heart. But then we, as we got lower, we saw the smoke from the forest fires. And, uh, that prompted a discussion about forest management. So that was one of the benefits of both Steve and I being have that quality time with the president is to be able to talk about issues that are important to Montana because they're not always as well understood back in Washington. Definitely, and real quick before we run out of time, your goal, maybe your number one goal heading back into Congress this next week. Well, uh, we have to get a farm bill passed here. Ag is our number one industry. Uh, the House did its work, the Senate did it. We have a bill in committee. Uh, so we're going to get that done so we have a safety net for our farmers. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for waking up with us, Greg. And now we go to today's Money Watch report.